Hi, let's see how to fix the secure from reported error hash 2000 in the GTA 4. Embarking on the gritty streets of the Liberty City in the Grand Theft Auto 4 can be exhilarating experience, but nothing hurts the thrill of virtual lawlessness like the famous sec emo securom reported the error hash 2000 error. This error has been a notorious stumbling block for the gamers popping up and preventing the game from launching but we are not interpreted the gamers because the solutions are in hand. In this particular video we will see how we can fix this particular error. Whenever you face this kind of error you see the screen like this. So let's see how to fix the securom reported the error hash 2000 in the GTA 4. The first method is install the Visual C++ redistributable packages. The game may depend on the certain Visual C++ libraries that might not be present in your system. You can visit the official website of the Microsoft download page for the Visual C++ redistributable packages. Download the latest supported Visual C++ distributed packages for your version of the Windows. Once the file is downloaded, double click on the executable file to run the installer follow the on-screen instruction restart your system or the computer after the installation has finished then finally you can launch the gta4 and check for the error is resolved okay so the second method is verify the integrity of the grand theft auto v4 game if you have the game on a on steam you can verify the integrity of the game files to ensure that the no game file is corrupted or missing open the steam client on Go to your library section, right click on the Grand Theft Auto V in your games list, select properties, go to the local files tab, click on the verify integrity of the game files and allow the Steam to check for any missing or the corrupted files. Steam will automatically download and replace any problematic files. Once the process is complete, try running the game again. The third method is run the GTA 4 as an administrator. Sometimes the game may require the administrative privileges to access the certain Files or settings locate the GTA 4 executable file. This is usually found in the directory where you have installed the game and right click on the GTA 4 X, X file and then go to the properties, then go to the compatibility tab and check the box next to the run this program as an administrator. Apply and then OK. Double click on the GTA 4 V executable file desktop to run the game. The fourth method is run the game in compatibility mode. GTA 4 is, is an older game and sometimes running in the compatibility mode for the older version of the Windows can resolve the issues. Right click on the GTA 4 executable file and or the desktop shortcut for the game. Select properties, compatibility tab. Check the box next to the run this program in the compatibility mode for on the drop down window. Select the older version of the Windows such as XP. Click apply and then OK. Try launching the game again. The fifth method is uninstall and reinstall the Grand Theft Auto V. Some of the simple steps what you can do is like you can just uninstall the Grand Theft Auto V application and then again you can reinstall it by downloading from where you downloaded it previously. Okay, so what you can do is like you can just go to the control panel and select the programs and features and select the Art Grand Theft Auto V. It will prompt for whether you really want to uninstall the application. Then you can just click on that uninstall option then it will uninstall the application okay so that's all about this thank you